everybody. Happy holidays. I'm here again ready to use my very good friend here to make him a cute little Rudolph being that the holidays are right around the corner. <laughs> Look at how cute he is. Um, and the holidays are right around the corner and this is one of my most requested faces <laughs> during the season. So let's get started. Say hi. Hi. Okay. So I'm going to start off by applying a base of this interference bronze color. I love this color because um, it's really nice and, and shiny and it's not going to look there on the face, they're just there. So I'm going to start off by just covering his face with this bronze and I'm just going to kind of go around the full face, sponging it in. I'm going to stop it over here. Keep on going. What a good model he is. Gonna just head up on the forehead two ways for the actual ears and um, for the horns. So I'm just doing a light base coat of this bronze color because like I said if you can really see the color uh, on the screen which I know sometimes it's hard then you can see how nice and shiny it is without looking just brown. Oh, look at how cute he is. I just love him. He's so cute. Okay. So I'm going to take my chisel brush and right in the middle of the forehead, I'm going to make a little flock of hair. Make a few spikes on the end of it. And I'm going to use the tip of my chisel brush. Just bring it in. Make kind of like a little... That's for the ears so that I know where they are. Now close your eyes for me. I'm going to start at the corner of the eye and create almost like a cat eye. And that's why this chisel brush is so good, because it goes right over the eye. Turn a little bit that way so that they can see. It goes right over the eye, and I just love that. So I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Can you turn this way for me? Start in the corner of the eye, go up, and just fill it in. I'm going to add a little bit more weight so that it's nice and bright white. Now I'm going to go right over the mouth area, cover that in. And I'm going to use the edge to just kind of fan it out. And then right under the chin, I'm just going to bring it right up. He is such a good model. I just love this boy. Alright, so I start off on the nose. I like to start in the beginning of my design, or in the middle of my design, I apologize. Right on the nose, I'm going to make a nice red nose for this Rudolph. Do you know the song? You do? Do you know that song? Oh my goodness. Maybe you'll have to sing it to me in a little while. I'll tell you that. I forgot I was singing. I forgot I was singing. It's okay. Don't worry. Maybe I can help you. Okay. So now I'm just going to take my black and I'm going to pretty much give everything the outline that it needs in order to emphasize the horns and, and just give it the outline it needs. So I'm going to start right underneath the nose, draw a line down, kind of like with a little triangle at the bottom. I'm going to give it a very light outline on the chin too. And out of the corner of the eyes, I'm going to bring, or out of the corner of the lip, I bring it up. I'm going to create the little dots right inside of the muzzle area. And that part's really up to you, how detailed you want to get in there. I'm going to give the nose a little bit of an outline. Can you see? Okay. Let me give the nose a little bit of an outline. Make sure that... Now I'm going to outline the eyes. Outline the ears. Close your eyes. I'm going to start in the corner of the eye. Very thin. Get thicker. Give it out an outline. I'm going to repeat on the other side, and this is this can be similar to
into your tiger eye or your cat eye. So again, I'm going to start in the corner, thicker, bring it out, turn a little bit this way, bring it out, bring it in. Now you can turn back to the front. Now again, I'm just going to give everything else a little outline, make my horns. So this is his hair on the top. I'm going to give it kind of that little flock look. Now I'm going to go ahead and create my horns, my reindeer horns. I'm going to come around, turn a little bit this way. I'm going to create my ear, and that's what that was before. Now I just gave it kind of a roundness on the face. I'm going to do this side, put the horn up. I'm going to go out, create the ear again, bring it down, and frame the face. Now to finish off this reindeer. Okay, so now for one of the last steps, I'm just going to accent with a little white to just fill it in where I need to. And add, of course, some red glitter to that nose because he's my little Rudolph, right? And he knows the song, I'm going to help him learn it again. Okay, just adding a little bit of white to kind of detail those horns and in the ear too. I added just a little bit on the nose. And to finish it off, I'm just going to add a little bit of red glitter to his nose because he is Rudolph and Rudolph has a very bright nose, right? Yes. Adding that red glitter by just dabbing it on. And this is a fast and easy Rudolph. This is just one of the many versions. So say Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Wave. Okay, you're all done.